Morning everybody, um, if you caught the last video that I had out, um, Slack Draw, I was sitting down, YouTube music was up, and there was just all these different artists on there that YouTube was re um, recommending, so I was going through and clicking on to watch later, just based on what I see in the the title and the, the name because I am out to try and find new music um, I think I spend too much time just listening to the stuff that I've listened to all my life um, usually Metallica that's what's running in the car constantly <laughs> anyway this one's called Kitty One Foot in the Grave um, I think from the from the um thumbnail I saw that might have been what it was that made me think I okay, go let's check this out so let's have a look shall we Just stopping there. Um, I like the the production part on the the vocal right at the start. It's one of those um, the you get the mic sound where it's just back, but it's fuzzy type thing. You know what I mean? Um, but then I like that it, it they came in with a, a fairly heavy beat, and then it picked up. But the one thing that I was just noting there, um, like she was singing with a nice voice and then she did a scream. I went, okay. And then when she started singing again, you could hear a growl in the background as well as the clean vocal. Now, um, if that's just a thing off the studio version... And she's the one who does the clean and the growl. I kind of agree with um, Nathan of um, the breakdown, where they're kind of like, what's that going to be like live? Because you're not going to have that both vocals going if she's the one doing it both. So. And I'm making a assumption here that she's the only one that does any vocals. I see a microphone near the drummer. So she does a growl as well.
So there's a good chance that it is the drummer that can do the, um, I keep calling it a growl, the harsh vocals, um, possibly when it's live. In the video, you don't see her singing in the background when the, the growl is happening, or I can't notice it anyway. There's just a few parts like right now where it's happening right now. Um, I like that there was the little mel melodic run when she was singing um, of the guitar, sort of kind of following the vocals. Um, just one part of it. I don't know if we went back far enough or too far. Okay, fair enough. There's enough there to interest me in, in checking out something else because I liked that they, they changed the tempo at different times. There was the just everything off and just the drum and the drum boom tsh, boom tsh, boom tsh, boom tsh. that's had a very familiar feel to it. Um which is just going, oh, what's that, that, what's that sound like? What does that sound like? Um, I was expecting a solo, just me, um, but I do like that they had the drummer doing backing vocals, both harsh and clean, um, and that the singer was also doing both harsh and clean. Um, that held back vocal was used a couple of times um a mate of mine had that sort of set up for his um harmonica in a band and it was a a, sep a separate microphone so that he'd have two mics one is his regular singing mic and then another one which would get that um held back sound to his harmonica so um that's just me being picky on the video because that's the way I would see that as being sung, having a second mic for that part specifically and it being very directional just like this so they can 
step aside to their vocals, to the other vocal, to the vocals, to the other vocal. You know what I mean? Um, and I'm glad I've, there was a lot of variance in the vocals in this, um, mainly production wise, just listening to the um, having that different mic sound, but she's also got a good, strong, clean voice um, and could also do the harsh type screaming and it wasn't overdone, it wasn't a lot of it and it wasn't um, so growly that you couldn't understand a thing that was being said. Uh, I said, I'm not sure where they're from. It was just on YouTube music, so I was being recommended. And um, what are your thoughts? Do you know of Kitty? Or is this the first time you've ever heard him before and you've just jumped in because you're actually following the channel? Um, but if you're somebody who's come in because you know Kitty, can you recommend another song of theirs because I can see there's one there called Eyes Wide Open I might just jump onto that at some point um, oh there's another one there We Are Shadows are they worth listening to? let me know um, thanks for being here if you're still around especially and um, if you are would love a like uh, follow or subscribe or whatever it's called now um Heading towards my 1600 at the moment. Thanks very much for being here. Catch you on the next one.